Hi you two. Welcome to today's writing for Monday term 4 of week 3. Today we, we are learning to find, interpret and comprehend information from a visual text. Now this is really important that we are not only able to find but we need to interpret and interpret will help us to comprehend the text. Comprehend as you know means understand. So let's have a look at the success criteria. Before we do that, remember that this is a visual text. So we're going to be using some different skills, but also some that we have learned before. Our first thing is to work out our topic, understand what we're talking about. What is it that we're going to do for our ride? The next that we have to be able to select important ideas in all visual texts, and in all written texts, there is important ideas and there are ideas that are not as important. We have to be able to work those out. And then we have to be able to write these in dot points or in sentences and be able to put them into our own words. That's very important. And of course, we use drawings to help us understand. So for this one, we're going to be looking at, looking at our science. These are the things that you covered back in term two, and I thought we could use those as revision because you already know lots about them. We have questions such, a, such as, what are the forces around me? How does swing work? Why do I need another person on the seesaw? And there are many other questions that we can answer. So what do I do? What do you need to do? Firstly, you have to use the QR code to watch the video. Now, my suggestion is that you watch the whole video through without stopping so that you can see what the whole video is about because we need to watch the video more than once. So the first time, watch the whole thing through. Now, this video is about forces and motion that you learned about in year two, as I said, and we're doing some revision of what you learned. That's probably in case you forgot something while we're in lockdown. What do I do next? Secondly, you need to start the video from the beginning, but this time stop it after everything you think is important or interesting and write it down in your booklet. So this one, you already know what's coming and you go, oh, that was important or that was interesting. I better write it down. And you keep doing this until you have watched the whole video. By that stage, you'll have lots of good ideas. So. This is a screenshot of me on my computer. I wrote mine on my computer, but you don't have to use a computer. You can just use your ordinary pencil and write it in your booklet as you would normally. And I've used different colors, but you don't have to use different colors. Now what? Now you have a great list of things that you have learned from the video. You can use this technique at any time for other lessons and you can learn a great many things that way. I hope you have enjoyed the little video and I hope that it's helped you learn and do some writing.